Hey y'all, coming to you from the International Headquarters of Scotty DTV, but I was at the 2018 SEMA show and I came across a 1966 Nova. Now you know I love these Novas and this one's twin turboed, so I loved it even more. I think you will too. Let me get the camera turned around, we'll take a quick look at it. How cool is that? Storm Trooper out, black and white. No door handles, no mirrors. You can't drive that! No, oh, yes you can. Get in the keys, go anywhere you want. You get pulled over, tell them you got a hot rod. I love these things. And of course, this one's got a great stance. Wheel choice is always personal, but I could live with the ones that, that were put on this wheel size and uh, design. Both look good to me. I like how they blacked out all the trim with the pearl white. Looks good. Molding around the rear windows is blacked out. I like that. Just cleaned it up. Not over the top, not crazy. You can tell the car is set up to drive. Oh, you gotta like that, right? Man, oh man. I'm a fan of those twin turbos. You see, clean. Got the good parts, I'm guessing, up underneath there. Looks good. But again, set up to drive. Probably could do a little auto crossing in this 1966 Chevy 2. Let me get that right. Top of the lines were Novas. Interior, pretty much stock, except for, you know, some modern upgrades. And of course, a uh, roll bar. Some better seat belts. I don't even know if this thing came with seat belts back in the day. But the rest of it appears to be the base, the seats, the headline are all door panels. They all seem to be what you would have found back in the day. With just a few modern touches. I like it fits the car because again you know this is one of those cars that don't touch it get the stance right put some good wheels on it and roll it that's all you need well i mean you can do more to them than that that's all you have to do to them i mean these things were were just basic issue chevrolet and when they came out they were the fastest car green light to production that gm had ever done and they didn't try to reinvent the wheel it was just all about cheap basic good transportation and then sometime along the way somebody said you know if you hot rodded one of those I bet that'd be pretty cool and boy in my opinion were they right because these things make cool hot rods yeah you know Got the back seat. I'm sure there's probably some pins on that roll bar to let you back there. I like that red indicator. It's in the details, and that to me is a really cool feature. Some billet uh, air vents. I like the console. Very cool. Like I said, good stance on it. No idea what's in between those turbos, except for I'm pretty sure it is a V8. But, that is cool. I didn't hear it run. It was parked when I ran into it. I was just glad to see it. I love these cars. Make very cool hot rods. And of course, it's the SEMA show. Where all the cool cars hang out. So there you go from the 2018 SEMA show. A 1966 Chevy 2 twin turbo. Hope you all have enjoyed it. See ya! Hey y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.